Wildcats and welcome to another broadcast of the Cat's Eye News. Today we'll be discussing ASTC, DECA, and Moose's understudy Jimmy on sports. My fourth hour doesn't appreciate my humor, so nothing crazy in the opener. Hello, Mrs. Van Hooser. All this and more on today's broadcast of the Cat's Eye News. Email us at nhscatseyenews at gmail.com with your story ideas and we'll be sure to feature it on our next broadcast. Be sure to send it to this email and not Mr. Letarte for the best chances of seeing your email. See you later, Novi. Hey Novi, let's take a moment to recognize DECA and some of our members' accomplishments this year. In October, they partnered with Pink Sisters, a Detroit-based nonprofit helping women battle breast cancer. And they were able to raise over $3,000 in October alone. Hopefully, they'll even raise more next year. In December, they participated in the District 6 competition, with 53 members advancing to the state competition. In March, they participated in the State Career Development Conference in Detroit, with 53 total competitors, 17 advanced to the International Career Development Conference. Then, from April 26th to May 1st, the International Career Development Conference took place in Anaheim, California. With 13 competitors, Yug and Surya placed first in the nation in the business law team decision-making event. Nice job, Deca. Hello, Novi. Your Novi Cricket Club is looking for a teacher sponsor to become an official Novi High School cricket team. Recently, they had a tournament and beat Wai High and Northville, but lost to Troy. They have put in a lot of work and are really looking for a teacher sponsor. So teachers, hit up this email right now for more information. See you later, Novi. Hey, Novi, the Photography Interest Group is having their next meeting on Friday, May 3rd from 3 to 4 p.m. in MC Lab 1, right across from room 182. They will be using Adobe Photoshop to edit pictures and more. Hope to see you there. Hey Novi, next week on Tuesday, May 7th, right after school in room 160, the Crochet Interest Group and the Classical Music Interest Group will be hosting their first joint meeting. They'll be making flower coasters for Mother's Day and it'll be a nice opportunity to relax and take a break from your AP test studying. Snacks will be provided, so if you're interested, fill out the QR code on the side here. What's up Novi? Last week, ASTC held their combustion experiment meeting. Here's the recap. What's up, Novi? It's Friday, and we're back with another Friday Sports Recap. Boys baseball swept Salem this week and have a doubleheader at Grand Blank tomorrow starting at 10 a.m. Girls softball lost both games to Salem and have a doubleheader today against Pickney. Lacrosse beat both Lake Orion and Utica Eisenhower and have a game tonight against Troy. And the boys lacrosse team lost against Clarkson and Howell but beat Belleville. Girls soccer took losses to both Canton and Brighton this week, and the track teams are still balling out. <laughs> Our girls and boys track teams are both still doing very well, winning against Howell by a lot, wow. and have an invitational tonight against Celine. Good luck to all everybody playing this weekend, and keep doing a good job, Wildcats. See you next week. Hello and welcome to the closer of this week's last episode of the Cat's Eye News. Just a reminder that seniors will be leaving in 13 school days. You're welcome. Goodbye.